but it's no, fine. Okay. I'm recording now. <laughs> so I'm on All my right. server with Phil, and it, we're recording so, this because, well, Phil doesn't normally play on here, but I recently made changes to the mob system. So there's now, uh, I guess you'd call it four times as many mobs as before, and you don't heal unless you sleep in bed or take a healing potion. And it makes the game incredibly hard. So like, these are all the dogs left over from Jinx and I's attempt to test this thing last night. The sun's going down now, so it's about to get bad out here. Where you would see like one mob, you see like six or more now. <laughs> Things are bad. Uh, we we want to get to the high ground, by the way. It's so much better on the high ground. <laughs> oh man, what is this? Star Wars? Yeah. Don't do it, Anakin. I already made that joke once though, so I don't want to overuse it, <laughs> even though I just did. So yeah, we don't need a mob grinder on the server because just having mobs spawn and killing them is enough, but... Um, Ooh, experience! Must get! Why is there experience flying around? Because we probably couldn't get it when we were out here last time. Self-congratulations, I am level 5. Yeah, so the because things are so much harder now, you get more experience from the mobs, because it makes it more worthwhile. Um, like, if you actually survive the night, which we did when we had eight wolves with us, um, I came back with, at level 60, which which is maybe a little bit too high, so we could tweak that. But, yeah, things are about to get bad. <laughs> okay, we're going to go this way. What are we on if things do get bad, by the we, way? We die. <laughs> oh, oh, cool. If you can get back to town, great. Oh, shit. It's starting already. Hey, a creeper. I think hey. I, I want to aggro it. You can go for that. He's already aggro. It's not time. Oh uh, yeah, during the day creepers are uh, non-aggro. Out. Uh, I wish I had my wolves with me. Okay, we're going to try and go this way. If you're paying attention at all. Oh, I was killing a creeper. All right, find you. You probably want to use the uh, arrows for archers for skeletons. <laughs> Everything okay. else you can use knockback on. Hey, you didn't give me that many arrows. Careful, don't run in front of me like that. Especially with the survival. Uh, <laughs> oh man, you're not even keeping up, are you? If you get separated from me, I'm not helping you. Okay. Not only go survive either, but to your left behind or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, that. Man, I need my, my uh, turtle beach here. <laughs> That's behind. Watch out for the Enderman. They're nasty. Yeah, I would imagine. The creeper to blow up on it. Okay, this is a really bad place. <laughs> you don't say. We're going the, the back way to the record studio. Okay. Oh, did I leave that in there? No. Ah, shit. Ah, shot me. Gee, yeah. <laughs> one out of any of these numbers of skeletons. Crap. Don't run in front of me, dude. I'm being pushed. <laughs> Oh man, we're getting surrounded. <laughs> okay, I better take a healing potion. Okay, high ground. That's good. Need the high ground. This is much harder without the wolves. Yes, I would imagine if wolves would make this a lot easier. You'd be surprised. I didn't help that much. I can kill it. I keep, keep us from getting swarmed. They kind of do. They kind of do. 
This isn't good terrain for them anyway, because they have this tendency to fall to their deaths. Did I just teleport when that happens? Um, it depends how far they fall. That diamond sword is definitely nice compared to the iron one. You're killing things much quicker. Yeah, quickly. It, it's essential. <laughs> At least you didn't give me one of those wooden swords. Enchanted level 50 wooden sword? Ow. I still don't understand the logic behind that, but that's fine. Oh, I'm getting hit by zombies. No, uh, ah, level studio. Sword. I knew we were going the wrong way. So, the more I've been practicing this, you know, just like surviving nights, the more it is getting a little bit easier to handle the ridiculously large numbers of mobs. But sometimes it's just so overwhelming. Like trying to go uphill. So, it's a cap 300, right? So, oh, they the still mobs. have the normal. Rolls. Yeah, but they spawn every one tick, which is also normal. So the record studio is kind of useless at this point because it's, it's too hard to crowd control. <laughs> I really don't want him on those torches. Yeah, gun pack. Not being able to take this is a definite different play style as normally I just take crap. Not healing, yeah. 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 Arm, auto healing to well, you can heal with through. the potions and you can heal by sleeping, but. You have to sleep till morning, and it's obviously not an option right now. Well, we seem to have secured this area, so let's head out. Yeah. Oh, oh, shit. Behind. I was busy talking. Let's attempt to head back to the city or the town. I better drink my potions. All right. Okay, I'm out of potions. How many you are in a uh, potion? Uh, four hearts, I think. It's a level two, so it's four or five parts. I don't even know how to make them. You gotta for trailing you. <laughs> oh. This is looking. This is looking not too bad. We can get through this. Yeah, piece of cake. Oh, there's three ashes over there now. Skeletons. I think my most hated mom. That's because they cheat. They, sh they shoot you perfectly when they're facing the wrong direction. That's bollocks. Yeah. One up here. Oh, there's any. Sniper. <laughs> well, yeah. I think go in this. Probably the better There's a creeper for you. <laughs> oh, I think. I did. I had enough experience in my life at the moment. <laughs> His guy's breaking up like usual. Oh. Yeah. At least I'll get to hear it. <laughs> yeah. So I would have um, been dead. No, don't strafe in front of me. Oh, no, I would have been dead several times over. <laughs> you if I almost didn't take got arrowed. I would have been dead several times over if I hadn't taken healing potions with me out tonight. Oh really? Yeah. I think, I think you tanked a lot more damage than I did. <laughs> right, so we are back in town, and the sun's coming up. I'll give you a tour. So this is the sheep place. I'm trying to tell about hearing. Yeah, check this out. So this is a um, semi-automated shearing farm. How do you, you automate shearing? Well, you push all the sheep near you, so you just you walk by and go smack, smack, smack with the shears. Oh, so, I see. And then all the all of it flows down into the center here and collects right here. Very nice. <laughs> Let's turn this off. 
the lag generation machine, really. Well, that too, yes. He kind of made it fancy. Oh man, you're using actual wood. Okay, over here we I have the cows. Wooden planks. Yeah, I had a creeper ball up there when I was first testing these new settings. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why they're now friendly during the day. This is the cows. Wow. That's rather unnecessary. I guess you have enough wheat, though. What do you mean it's unnecessary? They're for food and they're for leather. I don't know. I don't see a lot of use for leather lately. Yeah, it's gonna be for books that you can write in. I, yeah. Oh, that's right. That's this right. is the old cow place. Uh, no, this is the yeah the old cow place. So we don't use it anymore. Gonna have to find a new use for it. Stop canceling my running. Yeah. Okay, Jared, I thought it's an arch or something. Ah, there he is. Nice shot. Um, <laughs> oh, John Bow. I have nothing to shoot now. This is the pumpkin farm. We don't really need pumpkins that much, so... There's not much in here, but some pumpkins. Oh, is there a way to automate these and, like, mine them automatically with a piston or something? Yeah, okay. I'll actually show you what we do with the melons then. Well, no. I mean with the pumpkins specifically. On yeah, my server, I want to find melons. control structure out of pumpkin. It's the same as okay. melons. Uh, so here is the, the reed, which is just a giant mass of reeds. You can walk through this? Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, well, you, you smack your fist when you walk through it to collect it. That's... Uh, over Mine, here... I see my proposed Call of Duty map called Tall Grass, which the entire map is nothing but tall grass. I figured it would be a nice compliment to Nuketown. <laughs> this is the cactus room. Again, we don't really need that much cactus, so it just sort of sits here. I would use cactus more, but it destroys drops. Here is the the uh, melon room, so this is sort of like the pumpkins. You know, I'll just eat some food and then I'll show you. Well, yeah, there we go. <laughs> so all the melon you could possibly ever want. Wow, it, that, it grows that's... back so quickly. It's ridiculous. Yeah, nice lily pads. Actually, that is a good idea. <laughs> okay, let's come out of there. What is that, just pistons pushing them up? Or... Yep. I thought pumpkins could be pushed by pistons, though. Nope, they break. Yeah. Uh, here but we they go. don't break in the blocks, right? They break in the seeds? They break in the metal ones. So, here's the uh, chickens. Break. Okay. Uh, the wheat farms over there you saw before. This is the this is the yeah. apothecary, uh, or the alchemy building, or whatever you want to call it. This is now our most important building because we need these health potions. So, speaking of which, I'm going to put these empties back and get some. What goes into a health potion anyway? Blistering melon. No. Oh. Okay. So let's get out of here. Over here is. This might actually be the first building, serious building that group built. It's the library. Two enchanting tables. <laughs> A lot of bookshelves. Oh, nice alternating wood planks. <laughs> and over here is the town hall with the I and O. So this guy's got a head that's shaped like an I, and this guy's got a head that's shaped like an O. Input, output, and they're pointing at each other accusingly. So the town hall is where we plan out what we're building. So we've almost finished this blacksmith forge. That'll be the next building we show here. So, you know, some meeting rooms, things. And nice, nice, nice. Over here is well, the. Why did you pick the snow biome? It's got oh, there's a, a crevice nearby. So uh. this is the furnaces. Excessive amounts of redstone to make that happen. <laughs> this is a natural yes, lava thing here, so we had to use it as a feature. Okay. 
get rid of stuff we don't care about. There's just like a single lava thing like that? How did it happen? No, the, the pillar we made, but the pool was natural. Oh, I yeah. see. Okay, and now we head on up to the, the mansion. Just starting to come into focus. The, are you obnoxious. Here. the what? The, the doors are obnoxious. <laughs> So we put off building the mansion for quite a while because it doesn't serve a function except to look good and, and for us to live there. Ah, uh, yes. Looking good is not a function, by the way, viewers, that I uh, do very well in Minecraft. <laughs> he doesn't have aesthetics. No. I keep trading it away. It's a strange habit. We're here. Okay, so this is the entrance room. Uh, we've got a nice little picky hole out here to look out at things. Uh, the main kind of meeting room up here. Oh, oh, lag. Why lag? Why so much lag? It's probably the recording software. Uh, let's put on some... Well, really losing my stuff here. Hang on. Yes, yeah, so I'm recording again just so we can get the lighthouse before all my frames drop away to nothing, which they immediately did. So that concludes this story, I guess. Uh, in short, Minecraft is better with more mobs and, and no health.